Well, we are exhausted right now from work. It is now the present, and many of you know we just celebrated our one-year yeah. bus life anniversary. Ooh. It is kind of strange that these conversion vlogs are just now releasing, but, you know, previous to bus life, we were working full-time jobs and saving, and I definitely didn't have time to do all that editing then, so I'm just really grateful that bus life has given me the opportunity to like really be doing stuff I want to be doing. Yeah. We also wanted to give a huge thanks to those of you who just donated to our travel fund. As usual, we really appreciate it. And um, if you'd like to do the same, we do have a support us link in the description below. I really love when people send the donations that say beer for coal. Yeah. <laughs> We recently launched Patreon and that is support on a monthly basis and our beginning tiers are $5 a month, but some people just can't support monthly, which we totally get and understand. Yeah. Um, and that's why we have our support page, which gives you a ton of different options and ways to support us. Yeah. Thanks guys. We appreciate it. Thanks for watching. Enjoy the vlog. Bye. No? What? I was, <laughs> thought I'd start it like that. Okay. What are we doing? Do you guys notice anything different? Um, you look white or... <laughs> I got new glasses. Oh! I knew that. God. Let's check them out. Show the people. Model them. It's not modeling. <laughs> <laughs> Hi. Hello. Hi. Good morning. We Pull at every... At every opportunity, Cole likes to cut me off and turn the camera away from me. That's not true. That is m partly true. <laughs> it is. I just want to keep it, you know, zipping along, you know? Wow. It's the rudest thing I've ever heard. It's the truest Super thing rude. you've ever heard. What'd you say? It's the truest thing you ever heard? It's the rudest. Oh, oh, oh. I got the license plate for the scooter in. I got a new solar charge controller because I'm not sure we're going to be able to get our solar charge controller working and I don't know if that's the problem. So we're going to look at that today with Will when he comes out. Nine times out of ten, Cole has to go inside and get something that he forgot. <laughs> <laughs> I got it. <laughs> Alright, so we're getting ready to start the bus now. Um, we had kind of a weird situation the other day where my mom said that when it was super cold, um, our horn was going off for like an hour, uh, but not a like full sound, just kind of like a really loud humming, buzzing sound. So we're just kind of hoping that it works. <laughs> I think Anna may have been crazy, I'm not gonna lie. So, I don't know if I believe her. She's been tripping on all those drugs she takes. <laughs> well, why is it so cold in the shop, Jim? I can't see my breath outside. I walk in here. It's 32 and degrees. See... It's warmer than it was oh the other day. <laughs> this, is, this is bullshit. So, you ready to do something, Cole? Yeah. I mean, I guess. All right. So, what you could do is, is get a drop cloth set up somewhere. Yeah. And you could get a coat of primer on all this. Yes. And if you get it on early enough, a little later, that, that kills it pretty quick. Yeah. You could lightly sand it, and we could then bring this part in and mount it onto the cabinet. Okay. What else you can do is if you don't want those inside of those cabinets to stay the way they are, like the sink cabinet is in particular, yeah. and the one that has the pull out, yeah. if you want to prime the insides of those uh, and the back. I mean, I think you're, I think you did a nice job. Okay. Now, if you wanted to, you could take before you take right like this. Yeah. Take that wood filler, put oh, a little yeah. bit of that on there, just smooth it with your finger. Okay. That stuff dries pretty quick. Yeah, just okay. a little bit. You could do all that. Yeah. And I have to put one more little thing in here for that drawer. Oh, yeah. So I could do that, and you could sand that, and then this one would be ready to go. Okay. Looks like I'm going to start drilling holes for the hitch for the scooter rack. 
and Monica is gluing up some holes remaining on our veneering. On our cabinets. But you're filling in the veneer. Um, no, not really. She's Flip this over the way it goes and crawl underneath here with me. Welcome to the fun factory. Fuck! <laughs> ah, elbow. Fuck. This was a mistake. <laughs> See ya, Cole. Oh, God. Ah. Oh, shit. See ya. Ah. Okay, that was fun. Oh, I'll be back. Lord Jesus. <laughs> to make your life a little bit easier. We're gonna pre-drill those. And we're gonna clamp them on that and then you're gonna drill up through that and we're gonna get these mounted. Then these are gonna come down like so. And we're gonna mount this to that. And then this is gonna allow us to get around that. Uh, the bumper? Well, the thing that's hanging down there. Do you think that's going to be hanging too low then? No, no, it'll still, we can still make it hang where we want it. All right. Before we break that thing down, I'm going to drill Monica's hole so she can prime those doors. This is literally the worst thing I've ever done in my life. Like, you can't fully extend your arm so you can't get your full strength behind it. I can go like maybe 20, 35 seconds, that's an odd number, to before I have to stop because I'm getting tired. My back is wet because there's melting ice underneath my blanket and the drill just pumps out cold air. I, and it's super loud, just pumps out cold air. Something popped. And it's smoking and smells really terrible. I don't have that. I think it's these drive belts. Oh, okay. Oh, it smells terrible. I mean, it smelled like fire. That's why Rena got the fire extinguisher. That middle section. Yeah. That gummed up from that pine. Oh. Pine's real sappy. I am priming our cabinets right now. Look at these buttes. Cole's cussing a lot over there. I start to get really impatient when I get hungry, so I'm gonna take a lunch break. But I got the first coat on all of these. So, it's a good start. We're gonna go check on Cole because he's like losing his mind out here. Hey, Monica. Yeah? Can you give me a small piece of wood, maybe that's like a quarter inch, half inch thick? Okay. So Will should be showing up shortly to work on solar stuff. This hitch by far is being the most difficult thing. There's been a lot of frustrating things on this bus, but this hitch is like, I don't even have one hole drilled for the hitch brackets and we need four. Do you have the voltmeter? 
Yeah, I can grab that inside. Yeah, we're going to want to start there before we turn it on. Will is officially back to save me when it comes to solar. Thank, oh, whoa. <laughs> thank God. Are they capped? Yeah. Cap I was like, wait They're a minute. How, wait, how does wait, this plastic? work? plastic. It's like, new technology. I was like, how does this work? It's like a wireless charging through your iPhone. Oh, shit, I just dropped. It's all right. I'll probably lose those within like a week anyways. Yeah, maybe they have always come with them, and I've never seen them before. <laughs> yeah, or just threw them away immediately. So, battery. how are you doing your order of operations here? I've battery first, the lower one. So this one comes on. Yep, that's the battery. That'll, I forgot, I'm kind of relearning this a little bit yeah, here, sorry. That flips on the solar charge controller. Right now there's no PV. Yeah. And then you can flip PV on. Oops. And you, oh, it went up to, was it in the hundreds there for a sec? No, I think it was, hit about 38, 42. We have a battery charging through the AC inverter currently. It's... Man, I'm not seeing anything that's not looking normal. So, like, my question is, is, like, why doesn't it say, like, 600, you know, on the the wattage of the panels it's taking in? Is it only going to take in as much energy it needs so, to? So, yeah, the, the wattage is under perfect standard conditions. So, in a laboratory, um, in perfect standard conditions, it flash test at 350. You know, I don't think I ever told you the really fucking funny... Did I ever tell you the funny story behind the panel voltage? Uh-uh. Because -uh. Uh, last time you were here, we weren't receiving anything. Yeah, yeah, I remember it being, like, really small. So, what if I told you that I had left <laughs> the cables disconnected to the panels? That's, that makes a lot of sense. <laughs> I'm glad today it's actually got something coming out of it. We figured out how to work a multimeter. Okay, good. So what uh, what did you determine? What was the issue, or what is the issue, or did you just not know how to read the thing? Give us another like half hour. Huh? Give us another little half, half hour. hour. Still doing a little more troubleshooting. Yeah, yeah we. The first we're issue the is we're the trouble that's been. <laughs> the, the, the first issue is we couldn't figure out how to accurately measure amperage okay. and also the voltage with this meter. Okay. But then there was a nice guy on YouTube that showed us how to do that with this particular multimeter. Okay. And did this here. Let's go make sure we're. Not losing anything on our way down. Neat. I really feel like we're making progress now. Yeah, <laughs> Do we have regrets about setting this up on the backside underneath the bed? Yes. No. Because <laughs> you're not, once we're done, you're done. Yeah, that's what I keep saying to myself. That's that's the what you want to keep telling yourself. Current average, so I'm going to get a little bit of a spark, which will be okay. So we'll put that there. There. 7.6. If I was doing this by myself accurately, I would think I'd just be moments away from electrocuting myself every moment. So I appreciate you being here. Oh yeah, no problem. I've definitely shocked myself more times than I'd like to admit. <laughs> well, I'll just keep my hand on your leg, so. <laughs> keep me <laughs> goes, grounded. Goes through both of us. Let's fire some power up here. All right, I can throw the grinder on yeah, here. Yeah, let's see if we can pull some, because what I'm guessing is if, if you're demanding it, it might start letting it through. All right, let's see if we can do that. We just set up this drill to our AC, and once we start up the drill... 240, 270. The wattage of the panel, so essentially it's just showing what it, it is utilizing to charge the system, I guess, currently. Mm -hmm. And since, I guess since the battery is at like 14.5 volts, it's not needing the wattage, so it doesn't use it at all. Yeah. And it's just trickle charging it in. Okay, so that means I can... So things are working the way they're supposed to. I think the one thing that we should do is probably put your 100 amp breaker on here. And then if you could maybe help me hook up the uh, battery reader too. Yep. That would be good. And then we can um, start doing some sub circuits if you want to do any of those. Yeah. <laughs> this one's sponsored by, sponsored by Natty Light. <laughs> Brought to you by Natural Light. Oh, great. Natural. The king of beers. Now real beer companies aren't going to want to sponsor us. <laughs> oh, it's harsh. We're going to get it into a position where I feel comfortable that I can start wiring stuff after Will's not here. This Good luck with that, Will. Yeah, we're getting there. <laughs> <laughs> All right, so Will just left, and I'm just so grateful that he was able to help me out and, like, just... You know, I have the multimeter, 
I have all the components, but like being able to put the knowledge in place and helping me get the right readings and know what's happening with the system and figuring out that things are in fact working well. It's just there wasn't a current load on the system. It's just all super helpful. It's really inspired me and Monica too to kind of take the time to help others when you can. If you've got the knowledge and you have the time, uh, you know, help them out, you know. You've seriously done some work with wood today. I really have, it's kind of crazy. So I sanded this like four times. Um, and then I can show you our cabinets. It looks nice. It's nice and smooth. Here's our cabinets. Holy and, white. And drawers. This it's is just primer. Just primer? Yeah. <laughs> it's not gonna be paper These white. These are our ghost white cabinets. Yeah, a little too white for me. Um, so yeah, they look really good. Oh, look at this, the sunshine. This is nice. <laughs> <laughs> Prom 2019. Um, you really want to ride your scooter, don't you? I do want to ride my scooter, but I really am hungry too. I think this is the end of this vlog. Yeah. I feel like we did a little bit of everything. I never quite get done actually what I want to get done. <laughs> but. Yeah. But we happens. get shit done regardless. Just never what you think you're going to do. Yeah, I have faith that the solar is going to work out now. Yeah. It will. Well, it is. So. Yeah. <laughs> cool. Well, thanks for watching, guys. See ya. Bye. Until next time, boss. <laughs>